Welcome, welcome, welcome. You're here with Guma. What do you mean you cannot use contact? Fucking shit. Are you kidding me? Why is it locked? What the fudge you mean it's locked? Oh my god. It wouldn't be freaking... Ah, oh, it's not even YouTube now. It's bloody PlayStation. Wanting me to... Oh, I, I'm supposed to say welcome. And then I open the game and then the music plays. And then I do the intro. And then I say kept you waiting. And now I need to try to sign back into this thing. Sorry guys, it seems PlayStation is on to us that we're using our US profile to play games on our English profile. Let's see if I can figure this out. I'm just gonna have to uh, black the screen for a little bit. Sorry guys, sorry guys. I'll be back in a minute. Oh my god, sorry. I'll be back in a minute, I'll be back in a minute. I promise, I'll be back in a minute. <sighs> We're going to have issues. No daughter, apparently. Saying no data. Alright, it's saying no data, but it's live on Twitch. Uh, can you guys hear me on YouTube? Okay, you guys can see me on YouTube except it's saying no data. So, we seem to have encountered an issue with PlayStation where... It has locked every single game that I have bought on my US account, being everything, and is preventing me from playing it on my Australian account, which is kind of where all my saves are. So we've got a little bit of a situation. And the sound is apparently really bad. My sound or the game sound? But, um, sound aside, because I was under the impression the sound was fine. Let me hear it real quick. Of course, it's got to be issues with the PlayStation. Got to love it. Let me see if I can hear the PlayStation. Of course, the PlayStation sound seems to be crackling. Oh, but playing it... Of course. Apparently my recording of the PlayStation sound is shit as well. That's two issues. Okay, let's... Tell me if this fixes it. I can't believe this. PlayStation just fucked me. PlayStation just fucked me. All audio. Because it's supposed to be the same sound as I'm hearing here. Like, I'm hearing it perfect in my headphones. And it's connected to the Elgato cable. Like, it's supposed to be the same shit. I'm sorry to swear. Did this to me with a few weeks ago. Updating console helped me restore license things somewhere in the settings. Let's give that a crack. Sorry about this, guys. It wasn't supposed to go this way. I tested it, and it worked last night. It worked last night. 
Wouldn't be, um, wouldn't be a live stream without a few fuck-ups, would it? Alright. Restore license. That implies that they revoked my license. Which I basically ask why. Yeah, I know I purchased them, and I also purchased God of War, Resident Evil, and Witcher. Of course I did. So, what's this? Plus seven? I'm so confused. Plus one? I'm so effing confused right now. Is my PlayStation activated? It was. It was. Let's see if we can go. Okay, activate is primary. Activate. Change. I don't know why it would disable this. Seems like a shitty thing to do. I mean, I paid for them. It's not like I didn't pay them or something. Okay, I don't see the lock now. Hello, RWBY. Okay. Now let's try to fix the sound. Despite it working perfectly seconds ago. Okay, so, games should be restored now. Now let's work on the sound. Sounds perfect in my ears. Let's see if the sync works. MGS, hit. Wolf Among Us, hit. WW, hit. The Walking Dead, hit. Bioshock, hit. Bioshock, hit. Resident Evil, hit. Kingdom Hearts, hit. Near, hit. Alright, now let's see how the background audio is. Welcome to YouTube, ladies and gentlemen. sound. Sounds perfect in my ears. Let's see if the sync works. MGS, hit. What the F? What the F? How in the F is it so bad on the computer side? Alright, um, the only thing I can possibly think of is to restart OBS. So, you guys are going to get another blackout. Blood for the blood god, skull for the skull god. Thank you, Matt, but we're, we're, we're trying to get live now. I'll, I'll do my best. I'm going to restart OBS and pray to a tuna that it works. So, um, bear with me for a minute, guys. Bear with me. i just got to restart this. May Atuna give me strength. These technical issues are... These technical issues. Fuck my life. We seem to be back. The sound seems to be back. Bloody Sora seems to be smiling. Uh, 
Ahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahah
Okay, so Kingdom Hearts are a chain of map. Oh, well, at least they're nice about it. I'm guessing I go from top to bottom. Cool. They look a little bit older. Uh, Donald looks a little mean. And Goofy looks a little... What happened to them? Stop playing Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. And let me just double check real quick that I'm on the right profile. Ninja Kuma. Beautiful. Wait. Yes. Beware, this game is very slow paced. We should be okay. I'm hoping we should be okay. I can't see any reason why. Disney Interactive Studios. And I still haven't seen the last few Disney movies that they released this year. No, it's not top to bottom. Nani? Tinkerbell, Peter Pan, Captain Hook are Walt Disney masterpieces. New game. Uh, the difficulty is well balanced and it's more recommended for first time players. Sure. Please select your vibration settings. On. Please confirm. Yes. Sorry, I've got this little thing where I don't want to talk during opening themes because the music is so epic. So please don't think that I'm rude by not responding. I was reading everything. I've never seen Donald so freaking happy. Like, what the F? Why is he so happy? It's weird. Goofy's always happy, but like Donald's, you know, not always happy. So I was a little bit... What's going on? Are they going to sprint that whole way? There's no way they can sprint that. Oh, there's a crossroads. Interesting. Along the road ahead lies something you need. Oh boy, here we go again. <laughs> However, 
In order to claim it, you must lose something that is dear to you. Naturally, let's just build it that way. We need a roof. Uh, but sir, we ran out of roofs. Well, then build a roof on the side. Okay. A Game Boy game with cutscenes. I, I am impressed by this. And even Pokemon does that. grass field moments ago and now we're here okay sure just leave the person's door open <laughs> rude not getting invited to my home. Hey, you think it's okay to barge in? But we gotta do it if we can afford the king. The king? King Mickey's here? Something just told me he'd be here, okay? Really? Because now that you mention it, I was kind of thinking the same thing. Uh-oh. Seriously? Me too. One look at this castle, and I just knew. Our very best friends. They're here. Uh, yep. Yeah. Guess great minds think alike. Wait, hey, hold on. It can't be just a coincidence. Oh no, Timmy. You don't mean that. Yep, I had it too. Mm-hmm. What I is he even doing here? Feeling. It's like an episode of Rick and Morty. Of course. Maybe it's contagious. No, no, something screwy. We gotta go take a look. All right. Where are you going? That way, to the door. <laughs> are you scared? Ah, oh, don't be ridiculous. Come on, let's go, Goofy. Hey, fellers, uh, shouldn't we shut the door behind us before we go? Sora! Of course. That's it. Who are you? <laughs> You gonna beat him to death with a key? Well, hi, yes. Oh, yeah? I'll try some magic. Finger! Come on. Finger! Finger! Articulate thunder. Come on. Finger! Fire! I don't know. I beat him with it. I should think it's obvious. The moment you set foot in this castle, you forgot every spell and every ability you ever knew. In this place, to find is to lose, and to lose is to find. That is the way in Castle Oblivion. Castle Oblivion? Here you will meet people that you have known in the past. And you will meet people you miss. I miss? Riku! You mean Riku's here? If what you want... is to find him...
What'd you do? I merely sampled your memories, and from them, I made this. To reunite with those you hold dear. Okay, Kaiba. What's this? A card? It is a promise for the reunion you seek. Hold the card to open the door, and beyond it a new world. Proceed, Sora. To lose and claim anew. Or, to claim anew, only to lose. Oh. Come on. Let's go. Or you could like, you know, 180 degree walk out of there and be like, F this shit. Traverse town. Okay. I'm gonna pretend like all that made sense. Left click or directional button select card. You currently have only one world card. I mean, it looks smooth in 60 FPS, I'm not going to lie, there's nothing wrong with it, it looks nice, it looks polished, but I'm still confused. This can't be right. We're in Traverse Town. What you see isn't real. This town is an illusion created by your memories ingrained in that card. My memories? Forget about that, Sora. We lost Donald and Goofy. Donald? Goofy? Guys, where are you? What did you do with them? They are at the mercy of the cards now. Oh boy, here we go. Master the cards and their strength will be yours again. The laws of this castle require that your friends be transformed into cards. Confusion is the general feeling more kinder card players feel like playing. <laughs> Fair enough. If you value your friends, you won't fail to pick them up. Cards you pick up are added to the top of your stack. Use them and your friends will come to your aid. Final. The cards you use vanish, but they will reappear to aid you time and time again. Cards are the hearts of your friends. Everything in this castle is ruled by cards. Whether an enemy or a door confronts you, cards are the only way to proceed. But you mustn't forget your own strength. First thing for yourself, move and then use cards. You know how to use your strength, but it would be of no use if you lose sight of your opponent. I wonder if you can catch me. Good. Every move you make causes a card to disappear. If you use up all your cards, you will be unable to act. But there is a solution. Keep using cards until you run out, and I will show you. You have no more cards and without them no power. If you want that power back, you must focus. Bid the cards return to you and they will. The strength of your heart brought back the lost cards. 
You can recall spend cards at any time. You need only wish it. Each time you do, the cards will, ta will take longer to return. The cards are by no means unlimited. Use them wisely. Anticipate the flow of battle and choose the most effective cards. You may use any cards in your deck. The four cards type you use in battle are grouped into two wider categories. Oh boy. The first category includes attack cards, magic cards, and item cards. The secondary category consists entirely of enemy cards. To use cards from a different category. Cards will empower you whether you are attacking or defending. But it is up to you to decide when to attack and when to defend. Do not forget that. Are you two alright? Where have you been? You tell us, when you opened the door we saw a strange light, and the rest is just blank. Gee, that doesn't help. Try to remember what happened. I have to keep my journal up to date. Hey Donald, where'd I get the new clothes? Fuck, me too, Goofy. Someone's been messing with our clothes. Could it be the cards again? That is for you to ponder. Master the cards and make your way through the castle, but from here you walk alone. Alone? We can't let Sora go alone. Yeah, Sora can't do anything without our help. Thanks a lot, Donald. You sure you'll be okay? Of course. You want me to go alone? Fine. I can take care of my... You want me to go alone? Fine. I can take care of myself. Hmm. The hero speaks boldly. Go then. The rest of Castle Oblivion awaits. Walk the avenues of a later memory and shall beat someone near to you. I've got a bad feeling about this. Relax, Jimmy. I'm ready for any tricks he's got up his sleeve. How hard can it be to figure out these cards? All I have to do is use one in front of the door over there. Key of Beginnings. Whose idea was it to turn Kingdom Hearts into a card game? So let me get this straight. It's got the graphics of Kingdom Hearts, the gameplay with added cards, and why though? You can perform the following actions in the field. Move around, walk around, face forward, swing keyblade, jump, dodge. Strike an object in the field with your keyblade yields various results. Try striking the barrel. So it's the same gameplay of Kingdom Hearts, oh, yeah. except instead of combat, I have to play a card game. Whose idea was this? Marked objects can be lifted and thrown. Touching a Heartless on the field starts battle. But you can strike the Heartless first to gain the upper hand. Well, that failed. So this is basically Final Fantasy 13. Yeah, Final Fantasy 13, keep mashing! Tranquil Darkness. To open doors in the field, press triangle in front of the door. Uh, to proceed to the next door, you need a map card. Map cards are used to synthesize new unexplored rooms. First, select the map card you want to use. The 
this one. I'm really seeing the middle of the screen is the criterion for the door. The criteria on displayed now means the door will open with a value of one or greater. You need to pick a card that meets the criteria. Value of zero to nine, zero marks are special cards which meet most criteria. The cards without a marked value is a key card. Key, uh, key cards are only used at special doors. Why was a card game necessary? I don't understand. The swirling crystal in front of Sora is called a save point. Stand near it and press the triangle to save. Someone just wanted to make a Yu-Gi-Oh game but couldn't get hired by the company, so they turned this into a Yu-Gi-Oh game instead. Clearly. And I just want... I've been waiting a few minutes, but I just wanted to say congratulations to Elaine and Josh. They've been uh, Kumas for six months, so they've unlocked the new badge, and Ecto has been one for 16 months. So he's very close to getting his Monokuma badge. Just wanted to put it out there. Matt already has his Monodam badge. And so there's Fyam. <laughs> I'm curious to see who's gonna get the Monokuma one first. Okay. Can I go through the door now? So do I have to get more cards or something? Yeah. A blizzard card. I should have everything I need. So I'm sacrificing monsters to open a card. You're welcome. So I can't attack while Goofy's out? What's up with that? Wait, I'm trying to get my card back. I'm holding up an X. What's going on? I'm trying to get my card back. Go if you when you need him.
So I can't just kill one enemy, I gotta kill all these ones. And I lose cards when I get hit, right? Discovers there is an actual card game based on Chain of Memories. Why though? <laughs> Back in the uh, 90s, they were trying to figure out how. Now in the 10s, we're figuring out why. This is the card game. Fuck it, I'm throwing the barrel at this thing. Take my barrel. Fuck you! Yeah. Alright, let's see if I can get Matt through the door. Three. I gotta give it three. Oh boy, more of this. Am I the only one that feels that the gameplay is a little bit... Go for it. Oh, come on. Useless piece of crap! That's goofy. Damn it. Yeah. 
Do we even use CP? Like, that's the real thing. Oh boy. Can we smash this? Yeah. Take my barrel. Let's go feet. Of course it's not there. Yeah. What the F? What the F? CP limits how many powerful No! No means no Bill Cosby! No! It's like half of Hollywood right now. No, oh, shit, they're still there chasing me now. Stop it! Barrel! If I don't pick up that red thing, it probably disappears. That's Goofy! Who do you have to kill to get a Goofy around here? Oh, it has a lock on. The thing locks onto me. Top right has a mini map. If you see a crown on it, pull, uh, go there. It's usually a story related room. Oh, okay. Story related room here. how Kuma feels about XP, Fionn. That one is the reasons I put that playlist of RE.COM 358 days and the fact that 350 slash 2 movies is missing out a lot. I see. Ah! No, Bill Cosby! Go away! Okay. Doors embolizing with crowns are special doors. You need special cards called key cards to open these doors. But having the key card isn't enough to open the door. You need to have a key card and one or more of the additional cards are meeting the certain criteria. Pick up map cards to meet the criteria you can open the door. No? Hey guys, if I'm grinding XP, I'm gonna be playing Nier Automata, just saying. No, Bill Cosby!
was goofy, was goofy, was goofy. I love how goofy comes now at the end. Beautiful. I missed one room back there. And because I missed that one room, I'm missing... Oh, and I can't go back, can I? There are a lot of... Just let me in. You sacrifice your guards to get your blue eyes white dragon out. Oh my god. I have a feeling that I can become very good at this system, but this system would not be used in any other games. So what is the point of it? Sort of thing, you know what I mean? Like how often am I gonna play a hack and slash with cards? Let's be serious right now. How often? How often? Not very. What the fudge just happened? That's goofy. Damn it, those things disappeared. So I killed this thing and I didn't collect all its ore. And look what happened. It disappeared. Have I learned how to combine cards yet? I'm s I haven't learned anything. Okay, you guys say I missed the room. I see one I see one door here. How do I combine my cards? I love how everyone's like, Kuma, combine your cards. Kuma, use this strategy that you've never heard of before. Review deck. Le. Deck. I'm ready. So... I, I, I can't even. Hit him! Piece of crap. Black 
black room. Okay, so did I unlock a room then? Yeah. Is there like a secret room I missed or something? Because I didn't see anything. Okay, so I came from here. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. We were here two minutes ago, weren't we? Yeah, we were here like moments ago. Okay, so we went into that room. And then from here, there's this door. I don't know how to open this. He wants a G. And then a special key. But I don't have a special key. So I'm a little screwed. Get up. Follow the minimap. I mean, yeah, it wants me to open this door, but I don't have a special key. I need a special key to open the door. Where does one get a special key? Like that is the thing. Where is the special key? I am clearly missing one. You need to find the door that needs a key of beginnings first. Okay. What is this? Yeah. Oh, keys. Cards. Full maps in the menu? Oh, what the fudge? Oh, so I'm here. Okay. Thank you for that. back. One room up. So they want a one. I used up all my ones. It's called Key of Beginning for a reason, Krimmer. It shouldn't be far. But you went far. Welcome to the way that we play video games. We go to the last boss first, kill it, and then complain the first few enemies are too easy. Hmm. Fighting alone isn't as easy as I thought. You know you're screwed when your best friends are two cards. Don't pop out of nowhere like that. This isn't our fault. We don't know what's going on. Hi. What's going on? Oh. Pluto. Things keep getting stranger. What's Pluto doing here? There's nothing strange about that. We came to traverse town with Pluto, didn't we? Did we? No, wait. According to my journal, it was before you met Sora that you came to town with Pluto. Huh? He's right. We were chasing after Pluto and that's how we ended up in Castle Oblivion. But aren't we in Traverse Town? Well, it's not really Traverse Town. I think the card created this Traverse Town inside Castle Oblivion. 
Oh, who cares about that? It's too confusing. I don't know where we are, but let's just keep moving forward, defeating Heartless. We'll get somewhere. You better be careful. It's Heartless that are going to defeat you. Oh, God. This asshole again. Didn't we beat him? If you have an arrow pointing up, you can use higher than numbers shown. If arrow shows down, you can use numbers that are lower. Ah, okay. I love how you missed four of my comments about it. I'm sorry. Leon, it's you. What are you doing in Castle Oblivion? Castle Oblivion? What are you talking about? This is Traverse Town. And how do you know my name? Who are you? Eh. I've never met you before. Met the likes of you before. So basically, if you stay here for too long, you go nuts. Oh, okay. Quit playing, Leon. You fought all the Heartless together. You know that. Look, I don't know about what you're talking about. I don't even know your names. You don't? Sorry. I can't believe it. How have you forgotten about us? I feel for you, but you've got the wrong guy. It happens all the time. Don't take it so personally, Sora. How do you know his name? You do know his name. Now, hold on. Why do I know your name? You think Leon's just kidding around? If he is, it's not funny. Sora's really upset. Who's kidding around, Goofy? You and Donald are the ones who... Hey! I don't get it. Something's wrong with my memory. What's happening here? I don't know, Leon. Maybe Aerith was onto something after all. She said she sent some uncanny kind of power. And asked us to look into it. Well, this is as uncanny as it gets. Maybe you should take that Sora to see Aerith. Aerith, whatever. Yuffie, you know my name. Yep, looks like you know mine too. You know him? Nope, total stranger, but I definitely know his name. Strange, yes, but convenient. We can skip the introductions. Tip number seven, always learn new slates when leveling up. Think of them as new abilities. How is it that you can accept the situation so easily? I don't get you. Well, I'm gonna run ahead and fill up. Irith in. Leon, you give them the grand tour. See you later. Leon represents how I'm feeling right now. Confused. About multiple things. I guess it's no use pondering over it. Come on, follow me. But there are heartless wandering around town. I better teach you how to protect yourself in battle. Does he know about the card game too? See the numbers printed on your He does, doesn't he? They range from zero to nine. High numbers mean stronger cards. If you and your enemy both play a card at the same time, the higher card wins. Go on, try it out. See how it works? Playing a card higher than your opponent's and breaking through the defense is called a card break. Playing a lower card results in your attack being deflected. Even powerful cards can be deflected if the enemy's card is higher. Whoever is on the losing side of a break is left wide open to attack. Don't let that person be you. Cards with zero as their value are special. No matter what card the enemy plays, you can break it with a zero card. But if you play the zero card too soon, the enemy can break it with any card they play. In other words, it's the most powerful card if it comes last and useless if it comes first. Try and make the most of it. Card values also affect the cost of assembling a deck. Keep that in mind. Now it's time to teach you how to stock cards. You don't have to use battle cards at one time. You can also assemble three cards and use them all at once. It's called stocking cards. Stocking cards are using them in threes is much stronger than using cards individually. Go and give it a try. Stock any three cards in your deck. Some of you three cards 
stock cards becomes the value you play. The value is usually high and hard to break, and the combo attack deals a lot of damage. Don't hold back, show me what you can do. Combo attacks aren't the only benefit of stocking cards. Choose your cards carefully and you can unleash special abilities called Slates. Slates come in all varieties and each has its own unique card combination. You should try it out once you've collected more cards and land a slate or two. But keep one thing in mind. Every time you use stock cards, you lose the first card you picked. You can't reload it. The lost cards won't return until the end of battle. Relying only on Slates will cause your cards to run out. That means trouble. Ah, I see. Got the hang of it, Sora? Yeah, more or less. I'll pick up the rest when it comes to some real battles. Here, I found this lying around. You take it. Remember what I told you and make good use of it. Listen to Leon. Simba. Key of Guidance. Yay, we can open another door. Wait, did that door just disappear? Did he just kick me out? What a bitch. Okay, let's try this out. Yeah. Damn it, Goofy! Wait, didn't I? Oh. This. Yeah. Yeah. Damn it, Goofy! I still can't believe the Moogles in Final Fantasy 13 are for freaking Kingdom Hearts. I'm gonna have to replay Final Fantasy 13. This changes everything. It is now Final Fantasy is now officially a Disney game. Go away! I'm not interested in you. Ooh, these ones. I do agree with that being OP, but it's also kind of boring way. Plus, he doesn't have it yet. No, I do not. Okily dokily. Become as gods. Become as gods. I'll show you. Take it. Come out of 
putting new cards in the deck like Simba. Oh right, I totally forgot about that. Moogles originated from Final Fantasy. Okay, so now we're with these three. Again. I'm Pluto. Aerith, have you forgotten me too? I don't know whether to say nice to meet you or good to see you again. I don't think I know you, but I feel like you belong here. Yeah, exactly. It's like we've never met, but it still doesn't feel weird knowing your name. But I'm telling you, we have met. We took on the Heartless together. We are a team. It feels like you're right, but I can't remember. Then I guess you won't remember what you told me. In Hollow Bastion, when I sealed the keyhole. We may never meet again. But we'll never forget each other. So you do remember. He's right, Leon. I remember you saying that too. I guess I can't write it off as a coincidence then. Become as cards. Become as cards. <laughs> I don't have any memory of it, but somehow I still remember. I think your heart is doing the remembering for us. My heart? We don't know you, Sora, but your heart is full of memories of us together. These memories must resonate in our hearts too. Maybe they tell us things we couldn't otherwise know. So you're saying that Sora's memories are affecting ours? His memories do seem to have a certain power. Maybe it's like that guy said. Then this town is just an illusion. Something my memories created. And there's someone special to you in this town? How did you... Uh, I get it. My memories are resonating with yours. Telling you what happened. Yeah, a friend of mine is somewhere in this town. I mean, Castle Oblivion. Castle Oblivion? What's that? There aren't any castles in here. That's not quite what I mean. You're still not sure what's going on yourself, right? I don't even know if these people are real. Right, we just got here after all. I want to take a better look around. Well, they're not real. They're just figments of his imagination built from memories that he has. So all the information they know is based on what he knows about them. It's basically like that whole Evangelion instrumentality thing. Where there are ver multiple versions of you. The you that exists in your mind. The version of you that exists in the mind of others. Are those the real you? Or are they what they see you as? And is the you that you see yourself as actually who you are? I know, right? It's too trippy. What if Sora's having a huge high? Well, that. <laughs> I actually read this thing. Um, I was just browsing through articles. And apparently it's like, Hero runs into burning house to save neighbor's dog. And then you see it's a mugshot of him in the police station. And it's like, entire thing happened in his mind. He was high on LSD. I'm just like... But he's a hero for saving the dog, right? And then he calls the fire department. But then they find out that he's... You know... On acid. Try repeating that, Kuma, if you can. Explaining Evangelion? That's a mind fuck and a half. I spent like two weeks after finishing End of Evangelion browsing internet forums. Puberty can be weird sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what your puberty was like, but mine wasn't this, that's for sure. <laughs> right, we all just got here. After all, I want to take a better look around. I'm not here for the story. I'm here for the memes. Uh, then go have a walk around the town. They're a heartless, but there's no problem for you. So you know I can fight. I can't say I know, but I feel like I like believing in you. Let's leave it at that. Let's do all the squares make a circle. <laughs> I like that. You know the reference. I like you. I like you. Bill Cosby. Hey! <laughs> You're funny. I like you. I like you. Okay, so basically we just have to unlock every one of these crown doors. And that's how we piece together the story. Am I going the right direction? I'm guessing I am. And I'm guessing that that playlist that you linked me is basically just those doors, right? One incoming in about half an hour. <gasps> the meme. I'm into meme. I know the meme. I want some meme. I want some meme.
like how we're going on the, like the story binge because we've done everything in between. Puberty is like a coma, with fried chicken and masturbation. <laughs> ah! Well, what do you know? It's Sora. Hey! You guy? Yeah. Like I said earlier, keep in mind, pacing in this game is really slow. The DNA of the soul. Ooh. Oh, and you've got that, um, 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 your display pick is, um, um, the history channel. Yeah. It's not just the door, it's a lot more than just that. If you don't know what a card does, there is usually a description about it right beside the card. That's why I play time of RE 72 hours instead of Kingdom Hearts 24 hours. Well, I'm sorry, but the 48 of those hours is basically killing Heartless for cards. Let's be real here, guys. So what do you know, Sora? Wait, what am I saying? I don't know you. But you do look like Sora. What, with that spiky hair, baggy pants? It's okay, Sid. That's my name. So, you've heard of me, eh? Well, I can't say I'm surprised. Anyway, maybe you can help me out. A friend of mine's supposed to be somewhere in this castle. Uh, town. Got any ideas? Your friend, huh? Lately, this whole town is sees darkness. Heartless darkness. I screwed that one up. Can't even take two steps without getting attacked. In fact, the plaza's the worst. Well, there's a jumbo-sized heartless shows up when the bell rings. Wait, where does a jumbo-sized heartless shows up when the bell rings? If you value your hide, you'll get out of here while getting's good. I want to kill it for XP. Gosh, maybe we should leave. Don't you want to see the heartless? No, we don't. Well, too late. The bell. I call dibs on the XP. Be careful, Sora. Dibs. Mine, 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 mine. Oh wait, I gotta play this as a card game. Gotcha. Come here, giant XP monster. What just happened to my cards? Goofy, I choose you. Goofy, in attack mode. Attack it. I played Donald in attack mode? God damn it, Donald, you suck. Like Goofy in attack mode. Deal. No, I fuck, I wanted to play the Mickey thing. So you a card.
Come here, you giant paperweight. You're such a noob, you just smashed up a car. Use Donald to build a wall around the boss. <laughs> I like you. I like you. We're gonna get along. Maybe you should teach him that spamming cards won't work unless he combines them. Maybe. Do I sacrifice this boss to open a door? Guard armor? And now to never use the card again. Ew, CP, what am I, Bill Clinton? What's this? Sliding towards distant targets for a close range attack. Three card attacks of the same type. Value 5 to 10. Oh, okay. I will never use it. So your friend wasn't here. No, I don't think I'll find him in this town. But he's somewhere in this castle. I just know it. Kuma, you don't have any spell or trap cards. Bad strategy for playing Yu-Gi-Oh. Very bad. Castle like this town's inside the humongous castle? Huh, that's rich. He's probably right, Sid. What may not... What? We may not understand what's going on, but Sora does. He sees that the reality is bigger than just this world. I wish I was sure that was sure. You'll be okay, Sora. No matter what shape reality takes you, you can handle it. I may not remember you, but I know you in my heart. Leon? You're creeping me out, buddy. Take care, Sora. I'm a little lost, but best of luck anyway. See you later, Naruto. Your Naruto... Um... What's that girl that got... Um... Raisenkan through the heart? What's up? I don't have all the answers, but I have something to tell you. Your memories created this town, right? That's what the guy who gave me the card said. If that's true, then this town is just a figment of your mind, and so are we. So why is a figment of my mind telling me that it's a figment of my mind? So you mean to tell me the figment of you that is in my mind is more intelligent than me? God damn, that's deep. But you can't be a figment. You're standing right here. This town is here too. But I'm not really me. I don't remember the things I should. And I sense things I shouldn't. Sora, beware your memories. In the journey to come, you'll be faced with more illusions. Sometimes the shadow of your memory will deceive you to try to stay astray. Food? Ooh, you know the way to my heart. What food is it? With what? Tomato, couscous, tuna, basil. With pasta? Couscous is like a pasta? Yeah, sure, why not? I'll try it. Sometimes the shadows of your memory will deceive you. Try to lead you astray. Uh, what exactly does that mean? I chose CP boost 70% of the time. Important for stronger cards to put in your deck. Trust me, Kumi, you're gonna need those slays. Uh-oh. I'm sorry, I'm just another illusion. The truth is out of my reach. Don't say stuff like that, it's depressing. Stay strong, Sora. Don't let illusions distract you from what's truly important. Holy fuck, I just have deja vu. I swear to God, she was talking to him in this exact... Oh my God, the deja vu. My brain. Error. Error 404. Meme not found. Okay. Deja vu, holy shit. Sora. Are you ready to go? Yeah, be right there. I better get going. My brain just... Aerith? My brain just... Oh my god. Aerith! 
Probably not even pronouncing your name properly. Aerith! Where did she go? I was just talking to her. Well, Sora, she was a figment of your imagination. This stuff sounds like Matrix. This is worse than the Matrix. Aerith left with Leon and others to remember. I might need the whiteboard of wisdom for this. Huh? You worried us, just standing there by yourself. I mean, we had to cover quantum mechanics and quantum physics in Bloody Zero Escape, and now we're covering instrumentality as a part of Kingdom Hearts, the Game, Bo uh, the Game Boy card game. I'm starting to get worried. If we're covering this in a Game Boy card game, I'm worried for Kingdom Hearts 2. Which makes me worried for Kingdom Hearts 3. Is this what she meant? We're gonna be in trouble, guys. We're gonna need a bigger whiteboard. Alright. Review our deck. I called it Le Deck. What do you mean, what's going on with that? You just twist and separate. Achan, you need to work on your hand muscles. You're making food for me? That a girl. Is Jiki helping you? I hope she washed her paws. Alright, how do I... How do I sit, hit ready? Edit deck. Add cards. Simba. What's this? Not very powerful, but reliable and easy to handle. Simba lets out a mighty roar that deals damage to enemies in front of him. Where do I put this? What am I even doing? Spoiler, Junko Inoshima is the final boss of this game, and she teamed up with the Patriots. We are all fucked if she did that. Oh boy, you have no idea what's in store. You will need to push that whiteboard to the limit by the end of this series. Uh-oh. Okay. He deals ice damage, recovers HP. Limit 30 cards. Slightly extend the range of attack cards. So I'll replace this out for this one, right? Oh no, that was the positioning, whoops. All right, so I stacked them in that order. Right, 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 I get what I'm doing. Okay, so if I... I put it... Well, I'll put it here then, and I'll put this here. Of course we want to heal. Who doesn't want to heal? Oh, okay. Okay, I see. We good? exceeded the maximum CP. How much have I exceeded it by? Okay. So I gotta remove a few cards. Let's remove the shitty ones. Like the one. And the two. And the two. And the three. Done. Beautiful. Done. We're good. And I just obtained a new- I'm not going back to the deck build. Recommend that you have cards above rank 3 for now. This is true. Okay, let us proceed further. What's this? 
This is Devil May Cry style. Everything gives you red orbs. This plays exactly like a Kingdom Hearts game. The graphics and everything. I was worried I was going to get put into a game that's in no way like Kingdom Hearts. But this is Kingdom Hearts. It's just forcing me to add cards in between my attacks. I don't even know why, but whatever. It's such an interesting design decision. Like, who does this? Oh boy, here we go. Show me the memes. Okay, a guy in a leather hood. Um, not quite what I was expecting. Well, Sora, did you enjoy meeting your memories? You make yeah, it was good to see everyone. But what do you really want from me? What do you have to give? Oh god, sounds like a pedophile. <laughs> Uh Hello. <laughs> have I met this guy before? What do you want? No hog in the hero. Seriously, they have then a hot for card games? You would like to test him. Perhaps I would. Have we met this guy before? My show now, Keyblade Master. Who am I? Oh, my name's Axel. Got it memorized? Uh, sure. I'll forget it in two minutes. Good. You're a quick learner. So, Sora, now that we're getting to know each other better... Okay. Don't you go off and die on me now. Why does his voice sound familiar? Okay, uh, boss fight. Cool. Interesting choice of weaponry. Can't say I've ever fought someone with this kind of weapon. Thank you, Hachan. Just in the middle of a boss fight. Thank you. Wait, he can run out of cards too? Wait, are we both playing a card game? Why though? Right, fire. Shite. The longer this battle drags on, the more he's gonna have to... Good 
idea. I'll make it all stuck. Hey, it wasn't that strong. Ooh, she made food. Well, not bad. Wow's Warden boss fight? A little bit. Especially with the weapon. But in India they had a weapon like that, which is a circular blade with one handle and it can Another be thrown. One? What's it do? Fire? You make campfire. Hmm. Kinda looks like the card you used. When you made Driver's Town. I swear this guy's not real. Sorry, you're talking I guess to yourself. We're gonna need it to keep going. That's right. <laughs> Was he trying to... Did you really think after that introduction I would give up oh so easily? You were testing us. And you passed. Congratulations, Sora. Didn't they, they discuss testing You're before ready you now. fought? Ready to take on Castle Oblivion. Oh, God. You will need to follow your memories. Trust what you remember and seek what you forget. Then you will find someone very special. You mean King Mickey and Riku? <laughs> you will just have to give some more thought to who it is that's most important to you. The girl? Our most precious memories lie so deep within our hearts that they're out of reach. But I'm sure that you can find yours, Sora. Why me? You have lost sight of the light within the darkness, and it seems that you've forgotten that you forgot. The light within... darkness? Would you like me to give... Oh my god, it's Raiden! Sora, do you need it? I'm gonna figure it out for myself. If you're in my way... Don't worry, Sora. We'll protect you. <laughs> Good answer. Just what I'd expect from the Keyblade Master. Shut up, Raiden. But be forewarned. When your sleeping memories awaken, you may no longer be who you are now. God damn it, all I see is Raiden. What's this? Agrabah Olymp... I didn't even have a chance to read it. Axel is sexy. Is it just me or did it get Zarbon in here? Where are we at? Okay, so I think we just unlocked. There is no map. Okay, that is a scary concept. If we meet Axel again, you can leave him to me. Gosh, you think there are more guys like Axel and the other guy? Every time someone darkness the heart, take a shot. Moving to another floor erases all rooms you've created. If you return to this floor later, you'll need to make new rooms using new map cards. Did we get everything on this floor? Axel is gay. Got it memorized? Alright, he's very Zarbon. Gotcha. Did we get everything? I think we did. We did, didn't we? Let me just double check. Uh, world map. What's this? What's this card? Did we forget to get something here or something? What's this blue card? This room has not been opened? What's going on? Yeah. He is voicing Kelthus too, so it could be a setback. LOL! He fucking is Kelthus! Hilarious. Should we just press forward or... Yeah? Do we just go forward or do we try to clear everything? I have no idea. My god! 
it's it's kind of funny when you find different voice actors in different roles and then you figure out who they are and you're like, what the fuck? What the fuck, Keltas? He's always playing like guys with long hair. Swear to God. Swear to God. Wait, all right, tell me, wh wh what do I need to do? Tell me now, while I'm eating this food that Hachan made. Oh. Mm. He voiced Keltas, apparently. Sounds like it. Raiden and Kelthus. Hmm? Hmm. What's wrong, Jiminy? Well, you see, what Axel said back there worries me. What could he have meant by, you may no longer be who you are? I may no longer be me. How can I be anyone else? <laughs> of course. Still, you can't be too careful. Yep. Feels like just about anything could happen here in Castle Obliv... 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 Oh, yeah. Now I remember. We'll be okay. Whatever it is they're cooking up, we'll be able to handle it together. Of course we will. Like that creepy castle we explored together. The one with all those weird contraptions. Mm. When was that? Uh, I can't remember. What was it called? Neither can I. Gorge. Oh, it was, uh... Holla... Holly? Holler? Hollo something? Sorry, I can't remember. What? Stop goofing around! Goofy, sure you didn't make it up? Oh, I don't think so. Huh, their memory's as bad as mine. What the? The swirling sphere in front of you is called a warp point. You can fairly move to and from floors that you've already completed. Stand near and press triangle to open it. Well, let's save the game first. Donald has anime hair. Sora has anime hair. Goofy has anime hair. Everyone has anime hair. Hollow Bastion? Oh god, not Bastion again. Sora's level 6. He needs to be level 99. What is this? Can we just walk through the door? Oh, what now? I honestly prefer this one. The Forgotten Hollow Bastion. I honestly prefer this one. Look at an announcement. Good choice, we'll get amazing cards. Yeah. Already completed Kingdom Hearts 1? Yep. It's for some sort of contest. They're calling it the Olympus Coliseum Survival Cup. Contenders have to run an obstacle course battling each other along the way. Now listen to this, the great hero Hercules was also compete for the cup. It says here he's never been beaten. Sounds like fun. Why don't we answer too? I thought you'd say that. Wherever there's a contest, you're raring to join up. You're going to compete even if we don't, right? Uh-huh. Guess we better tag along then. Hold it, everyone. There's more. Only contenders who finish the preliminary course may enter the main competition. It says the preliminary course is just ahead. That's what we're waiting for. Let's go. 
And yes, you need to do all five places before you proceed with the story. Seriously? This is Hades, right? Hercules is a model of true strength and gallantry. The perfect hero. Oh, he's perfect, alright. Perfectly infuriating. I was thinking about that little sunspot makes me boil. Ho! Oh, I drag him into the underworld. Which is why you hired me. Oh god, it's, uh... I'm gonna go with Cloud? That's right, you're my man. Cloud, is it? Okay, let's have to remember that. Your job is to beat Hercules in the game, and once you've got him cornered, finish the job. Do that for me, and you restore my lost memories. As we agreed, you have my word. I mean, the actual story. Oh, gotcha. Key of beginnings. You mean main story? Not interested in you guys. Oh, of course they could attack me. What? What? Freeze. Ah, monkeys. Simba, raw. Where's Goofy when you need him? I would say not interested. Oh god damn it. What's good if you when you need him? Go Simba! Yeah. Wait, why did it restore my cards? I'm trying to stack it so... Powerful one! Fire Zimmy's out. Yeah. 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 Zimba. Second, yeah, but you lose the cards for the entire fight. I don't want to lose them for the entire fight. I need them. Damn 
guess that's the way. Ah. Yeah. Okay. So this is the card of victory. Damn it. God damn it! Power. Freeze. Yes. Yes. Eyes can't hurt enemy Kuma. You are healing them. What? Ah, oh, they want the door beginning. What, I can't use the door of beginning? Do I want a green card? Oh, I get it. So you use the first one to use the door of beginning, the second one to open the second door, and the third one to do the third. Huh? Where'd you come from? Don't tell me you guys finished the preliminaries. We sure did, and now we have go for the cup. Well, you came to the right place. Not that you stand a chance again, Herc. Why not? Two words. You ain't heroes. You're wrong. That's three words. Yeah, he said three words. Exactly, but that's not the point. How can you prove we're heroes unless you give us a chance? He's right, Phil. They cleared the preliminaries. I think they deserve a shot. The stuff enemies drops are XP. They do disappear, so always collect them when they drop. Just defeating ordinary enemies doesn't grant XP if you don't collect they, what they drop. That sucks. You got a point there, Huck, but still. Of course, we could always cancel the games. Cancel them? What for? Old Phil's preliminary course was so hard no one else could finish it. Is that right? Well, if you let us compete, you won't have to cancel the games. How about it, Phil? Okay, you got me over a barrel, so fine. Here's how it works, kid. It's Sora, not Kid. Sure, sure, kid. Since your team and Hercules are the only contenders. No, they're not. The games have a new challenger. Name's Cloud. The more the merrier. Now the games will really be something to see. I'm looking forward to this. Don't expect me to pull any punches. Hey, as long as... You don't expect me to take them. Let's give it our best. Hmm. Okay, let's get this show going. But first, I gotta explain the rules. Rule number one first one through the obstacle course wins. Rule number two in the event of a tie, a battle will determine the winner. Rule number three you can interfere with your opponent on the course. And finally, rule number four all challengers have to give everything they've got. Alright, enough 
with the spiel. On your marks, get set, go. Why is he walking? Key of Guidance. Do I literally race them? What? We don't even need this one. Fuck that. Oh no, this one doesn't open shit. And we have to go through this one. Ooh, we're seeing a lot of old faces coming back. Uh, use a one. That's an eight. It's a two. That ain't running for no one. Lol. Is an asshole. Ah! Oh, give me a break! My god, I'm forced to collect XP. What is this collecting XP? Oh god, it's Pepsi Man. He's going to drown us. I, l I finally learned what Cloud got his costume. Oh god, they're coming again. Wait a minute. So every freaking enemy on that thing is gonna attack me like this and create a room of enemies? Is this a joke? What do you mean he broke that card? That was like a zero card. It should have been anything but useless. So if I attack him while he's attacking... What the? Oh, come on. This is relentless. Is this because I used that relentless card? So if I use the relentless card, this is what happens. No. I did this to myself. I 
need more Goofy. Yay! What would you prefer being drowned? Diet, zero, or regular? Zero, please. Kuma, if you get Goofy, I recommend using him in slight on the first shot. Oh my god, this room. Okay, I got told him now. Well, Simba, please. Oh, so Goofy and Sim uh, and Singo are not in the deck, so they don't get removed. That is sneaky. I like it. Oh god, I get this stuff up. I have to. I think I'm yeah. getting the hang of this. Damn it. Of course that happened. Oh, I have to collect experience. Premium room. Yeah. Oh my god. What have I done? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this is the definition of freaking relentless. Finding anything because I still need them. Thank you. Let's give it a shot. Have we like at least killed? Oh fuck me! Oh. 
Uh-oh. That arrow just... Oh my god. Power. I need more AoE. Oh my god, rank 9 Goofy, fuck me. Can we fucking stop with the things, please? Oh, thank god they stopped spawning for a second. Did I just lose my cards? Tip number 11, any cut about 7 is OP. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, I need a 3 and above. Let's see, let's see what we've got here. A map. Okay, silver, that's the goal. Game will do everything to piss you off. I'm avoiding combat. Ah, uh, a room where only a few darkness appear. I'll take that. No, that's an eight. A room where heartless with strong cards will appear. A room where heartless are drowsy and easy to ambush. Am I getting the hang of it? Sort of. I'm seeing that I'm sort of picking my own adventure. I don't know whose choice it was to make this card game though. I think after this stream we might just watch all the stuff. Let's complete this world properly. And then it's sort of... Oh my god, look how many of them there are. Kind of like Binding of Isaac, except he makes rooms. They're all drowsy and easy to ambush, but there's so many of them. Okay, I got rid of the hard ones. Yeah. 
Okay, so I can set up my deck in a certain way to make it easy for me. I can see the value of modifying your deck to make your life ten times easier. I'm definitely getting the hang of it. Yeah, a lot better. Just, the more I focus on this, the less I can focus on reading. You don't have to defeat them all, the only necessary ones are the bosses. Defeating all of them is a game changer in games like this. Pretty sure that's just Kingdom Hearts one. Okay, now I can actually just move around. Yeah. Okay, that's cool. Yeah. Okay, that's done, and now we just open this door. Ah, oh, we don't have the card required for this door, do we? We don't. And let's see if we can do something to our deck. Edit our deck. What's this? Powerful with a quick recovery after card breaks. Not very powerful, but reliable and easy to handle. What's up with this deck? Okay, so this is my deck. I don't need that. Let's make our deck. Let's start from the beginning. How do we... All reliable, easy to handle. Powerful with a quick recovery. Powerful. Let's keep it strong. Cool. Um. There we go. Fire damage. Simba. The zero should definitely go here, and that should go here. There we go. That should make it a lot nicer. 
So we have mainly powerful cards. And we can't really go through that one, can we? I don't want Relentless, though. Will this open it, though? I thought this was a three-door. Oh, so it opened. Okay. Alright, let's see how a cool deck goes. Oh, got broken. Got broken. Okay. Fire! Courage! Okay. Heal. We heal up and go zero. And then we'll take the cards back. And then break them. Wow, those cards just like dropped like it was nobody's business. Power. So we might at least take a few people out with him. Fire. Just one out. Donald. Cool. Got that one out. Damn it, you got a five. Fire. Six. I hope they drop strong cards. You can literally make rooms with enemies if you want. Can we have more than just red cards? Don't forget. Oh yeah, right, I totally forgot that one. Power. Let's make an OP deck. Burn him. So quick heal. So, you make the rooms yourself with the cards that you input. Powerful cards, so there should be some powerful cards here. Nah, nah. What? Oh fuck, I created a room with pow- Oh, fucking monsters with powerful cards. Not monsters that drop powerful- 
I just realized what I've done. I just realized what I've done. Wow, and it broke my card. I've created a terrible situation for myself. God for that. Kuma, I made a bad mistake. You pick a room which has enemies with strong cards. I thought it would be good rewards, like as in they'll drop good cards. I made a terrible mistake. Fifteen. A room containing treasure. Just treasure and no enemies, please. It's good to get the grinding better. XP drops from enemies. Otherwise, we want to try avoid enemies in this room. You can change the room again. Oh god, it's Cloud. Gosh, that was nice of him to wait for us to catch up. He's not waiting. Rule number three: you can interfere with your opponents in the course. He's looking to narrow the field. You can put that away. I'm not looking for a fight with you, so keep moving. Hmm? See? He was waiting for us to catch up. Well, we've caught up. Let's take him up on his offer and keep going. I don't see a downside. Listen, are you sure? I'm not here for the cup, just Hercules. Today he loses more than the competition. You don't mean, but why? This is business. Stay out of it. Go win your cup. Do you realize what you're doing? Rule number three, you can interfere with your opponents, right? You're not the only one who wants to fight Hercules. Big mistake. God damn it! I swear he's got to be overcompensating for something. And why does he even have that thing over it? Come on, give me your best shot. Is that the best you can do? God damn it! What do you mean I, my card got defeated? Fudge! 
I swear to God, I had a higher card and it still kicked my ass. Let's try again. Let's fight him. Oh, okay, let's try not to look at the cards too much and just like... Come on, give me your best shot. Get fucking in there! He just fucking took out my heal. What the fuck? So my heal got taken out. So if he hits you, your heal disappears. Gotcha. Gotta be very careful. We don't really need fours. Try that. We almost had him in the first combo. He's gonna keep losing cards like that. Yeah. <laughs> 
So he's gonna be losing cards. If he's doing that boost, he's gotta be losing a few cards. Because they disappear once he uses them. See, now he's doing another slay. So he's gonna be using a seven card, which is a really powerful one. So he's gonna be significantly weaker after this one. How many cards up on this? Yeah. Okay, now he's using a four and a six and a one, so he's gonna lose those four cards. Massive number. Does he just have randomly cards that break mine? Go away! He's gonna be losing that four now. Courage. Fire. Fuck off. Wow. 
Why is this zero so powerful? Fuck you! OP bastard! This better be a good card. High potion. Rank 3? But that's not even high. I think we have enough CP. We don't even use this. Zero breaks any card, but can also be broken by any card. Yeah, but like, he uses one card 10 times. Clyde, where'd he go? He headed for the finish line, we better go after him. Right. Kill Truth. Okay, so this room is gonna have rewards. What? That room closed, but it was supposed to have like powerful items. Okay. Well, that's not gonna open it. Well, I'm supposed to... Well, I don't have that key, so what am I supposed to do? Room of Looming Darkness, so I'll go this way. I go, and then I go, yeah. Can you, Sora, for fuck's sake. Yeah. Oh God, no, no, no. Oh God. Do they have powerful cards? They fucking do, don't they? Ah, it's a three. Mine beats it. Killed one of them. Use the five. I use that. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. If I do this, do this, and do this, and go like that. Come on, Donald, I need a high Donald card. Mm. So you can use crappy cards to boost okay cards. Fire! Hell yeah! Oh! It's a good card, I think. Fire 6, hell yeah. That's what I was after. So it's a room with good rewards, I'm guessing. Okay, so there's nothing we can do here. So we can't do anything in that room. We gotta go this way. That lies the problem. How do we? Oh, okay. We're gonna go back to. 
So back one more and then we'll get the door. And it's here. Oh, okay. We need a red one. Premium bonuses. Who doesn't like premium bonuses? I want a premium bonus. Like an extra strong reward. Will I get it though? You lost. Give it up, Cloud. We're not done yet. I can't guarantee your safety if we keep going like this. Better worry about yourself. Looks to me like you're slowing down a bit. Ugh. Don't worry, I'll back you up. Sora? Get all the backup you want. I'm going to finish you and get back my memories. Your memories? Now, now, Cloud. We don't want to spill the beans. Hades, you... Looks like you've oversold yourself. All you did was wear him down. This doesn't look good for your performance rating. Let me put it this way. You, my spiky head friend, are fired. Hmm? But my memories, we had a deal. Did you really think you could get your memories just like that? Get a grip. Why you? Out of the way, I'll take care of it rules myself. Hey. Rule number five, it's never too late to enter the games. Hades, you were behind this from the start. Cloud may have failed to take you out, but he did break you down. Time for plan B. Pack your Peter hook, because you've just won a free trip to the underworld, paid by me. Hold it. Sora, no. Come on, Herc. How can you... How can you, we go one-on-one -on -one if you're in the underworld? Good point, kid. I guess you'll just have to go with him. Rule number six, there are no rules. Oh, boy. You won't get any bonuses? Damn it. I just wasted a card. Take that! Take that!
Piece of crap. Take that. 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 That's it. 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 Take that. Yeah. Take that. 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 That's it. That's it. What the hell? What the hell? What the hell? What the hell? 
Oh. Uh. Game's cancelled? How come? I don't know, the king of the fucking underworld crashed them. Ugh. Two words. Everyone is pooped. Wait, that was more than two. You gotta be kidding. What about my match with Hercules? I'm sorry, Sora, but you wouldn't want to compete in this condition. Let's have a match when I've rested up a bit. Can we wait? Can you wait? Okay, I'll hold you to that. Then it's settled. Sora, over here. It's coming around. Why does he have golden nails? You okay? Yeah. Sorry I messed up your games. Hope you get your memories back. Forget about what Hades said. Sometimes the tiniest thing you can remember stuff you forgot long ago. If it's an important memory, there's no way it could ever be gone forever. That's what I think anyway. What the hell? Did he just give me his number? That's for you, for helping me out. Sure you don't want us... Uh, sure you don't want to co just come with us instead? Not interested. Brass claws? What do you mean he's only a card four? Fuck off! He was spamming cards eight like nobody's business two minutes ago. What do you mean he's only a one? Boost the power of attack cards when low in HP. Ooh, fire six. Okay, fine. I'll, I'll take something out. Um, oh my god, that is expensive. How expensive is Cloud? 31? Maybe forget about that one. That's a lot better. Alright, let's go save the game. Flipping Cloud, come on. Cloud's such a- oh my god. You don't even use enemy cards. Why do you put them in the deck? Actually, no, you can use those abilities in BBS except for summons. I don't know. Man, we use that card for extra loot in that room, and there's no loot in that room. I'll go away, I don't even care. Where can I save the game? Oh, we can save it here. So you, we pretty much have to go through all those worlds in order to um, progress this game's story. I'm honestly, just because how long the gameplay takes, tempted just to watch the cutscenes. I don't think skipping the gameplay is going to take away from the impact that are the cutscenes. Yes, we're not going to do the boss fights, but let's be fair for a minute. 
playing an extra 48 hours for the challenge of boss fights, I don't think is worth it. Same reason why we didn't do um, the Colosseum in Kingdom Hearts 1. I don't reckon it's worth it. We played the intro stage and the Colosseum. We've seen the gameplay. We've sort of gotten the hang of it. But I don't reckon it's worth to finish the entire game with this gameplay. Just because, like... What's the point? <laughs> like, what is the point? Let's just watch the cutscenes, get the story, and move on to Kingdom Hearts 2 or 380 Days or whatever the fudge is next. I think that's the better way to go. So next week, let's just sit back and watch the cutscenes. It's probably just going to be us chilling for two hours watching cutscenes. I reckon let's just do that. Just watch the playlist. Could you relink the playlist in the Kingdom Hearts thread? That would make it awesome. Now I have to go with Hachon and get a haircut. No, first dentist, then haircut. The plot progresses after a certain number of flaws. Every one or two. Let's just watch the cutscenes. Would anyone want to see another game like this one? Gameplay, that is. It changes the mechanic because in the first game, you just have to keep dodging until you can get your attack, you know, in between the enemy's attacks. Whereas in this one, you can literally break the enemy's attack by using a stronger attack and you don't need to use the block mechanism. It's different. I think this makes the gameplay a little bit easier because you can use attack patterns to your favor. You could in the first one as well, but it's a lot more tricky. But in this one, you could sort of predict it because you can see exactly what card is using so you can break it or you can wait for it or you can stall the boss. You're only saying that because you're afraid of staying stuck on a boss fight in the game, lol. No, I'm not afraid of getting stuck on a boss fight because we can always go backwards, grind a few levels and come back and kick their butts. It's more so that we're going to add 48 hours of gameplay, which is the equivalent of 12 streams for the sake of gameplay. Why? <laughs> if it was something addictive that was really fun, sure. But we're literally playing a, a card game in the middle of a hack and slash. Meh. M Sorry. Meh. I don't see why watching cutscenes only is a solution. In that case, you could do that with all the Kingdom Hearts, can't you? You could. You could. Was the final episode of your Let's Play for Kingdom 1 deleted? It only goes up to 9. I believe it had a copyright issue. I might have to go back and see what's up with it and export the ones that had issues. The enemy can also break you, making it a double-edged sword. It's mostly up to your strategy. Watch the first CD in the playlist before you leave. It's in Kingdom Hearts. Uh, it's tricky because I'm playing on the PlayStation and I can't get access to the playlist. So I can't actually pop it up on screen. I have to manually search for it. And I gotta go to the dentist. We've got our appointment in 50 minutes and then I gotta go ahead and get a haircut. What did you miss? James, you come right at the end of the stream. You missed the entire stream. James! Oh my god! I feel so bad being the one to say that. You missed two floors, yes. But we're wrapping up the stream because I gotta go to the dentist and hutch on two and then I gotta go get a haircut. I didn't get it last week, so my hair's all fuzzy and everywhere. If you saw my post on Twitter and Instagram, my hair's like... So long now, it's spiky and everything. Trust me, there's pretty much no grinding. There's just a second playthrough as a different character that adds 10 hours. So, how many hours is this thing then? I think if we... It's five minutes, but the thing is I can't actually click the link. The PlayStation is on a different thing. Like, I can't put the computer screen on the thingy because it's thingy. 
Can I, though? No, I can't, because... Will this put on the 4K monitor? Yeah, that wouldn't work. Oh, but it's doing like a 1080p view, is it? I mean, I could try. Let's see if I can... Yeah, but I'm on a 4K screen, so it causes an issue. Where does the screen end? It ends here, doesn't it? It ends, like, here. Does it? So weird. It, it's too messy. If I try to do it here, it's going to create issues because my secondary screen is a 4K monitor. Same length as Kingdom Hearts 1. I guess you can check the Good Beast playlist. I, I reckon we're just going to go with the cutscenes. I'd rather watch the cutscenes and move on to Kingdom Hearts 2. Card games are not my forte. There's only 12 floors, 2 hours per floor. I feel bad that we just lost a good card. I just gave a card that's supposed to give us rewards in a room that doesn't have rewards. Alright, we'll think about it, but my, my gut is telling me to just watch the cutscenes, avoid the card game, and move on to Kingdom Hearts 2. That's, that's what my gut is telling me. But I will go back and see which episode, uh, which videos of Kingdom Hearts 1 are not in the playlist because we did have some copyright issues because of the songs. The songs created a copyright thing. So I, I reckon let's do that. Let's just watch the cutscenes for the card game and then go with Kingdom Hearts 2. Kingdom Hearts 2 is the one, right? Even if you watch Chain Memories cutscene, there's another game which is cutscene only. Kingdom Hearts 365 slash 2 days is one you might want to see the cutscenes from because some of the later bo bosses are very tedious. It's a better sequel than this game. So it goes Kingdom Hearts 1, Chain of Memories, 365 days or Kingdom Hearts 2? Which one goes first? Kingdom Hearts 2 or 365 days? I don't know which one comes next. They don't they don't help with the titles. <laughs> they really don't make my life any easier. So after cutscenes, well Kingdom Hearts won the vote and this doesn't count as a game if we just watch the cutscenes. So we'll just move to Kingdom Hearts 2. Is it Kingdom Hearts 2? Two. So let's do Kingdom Hearts 2 next week. Easy. Easy. Let's do Kingdom Hearts 2. Storyline-wise, well, that's like saying play Devil May Cry 3 before Devil May Cry 1. Let's play Devil. Uh, let's play Kingdom Hearts 2. Release-wise 2, then let's do Kingdom Hearts 2. Let's play it the way they released it. Mm, if it happens before 2, that's fine. But... If the release sequence is two, then we should play the way they released it. Yeah, it has two spoilers, so it's better to view it after Kingdom Hearts 2. That makes a lot more sense. So we'll do Kingdom Hearts 2 next week. And we still have Mass Effect tomorrow. So I'll see you guys tomorrow for Mass Effect. I'll try to take a look which videos got taken down for Kingdom Hearts 1. We even had a Danganronpa video get taken down because of copyright. Um, and try to really quickly edit it out for you guys. Because I know a few people didn't get to see it. So I'll do my best with that. It's just a bit tricky with working Monday to Friday. I have no time Monday to Friday. No, watch the cutscenes or I will cut you. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, yeah. we Oh, uh, fuck. I totally forgot. Oh, okay. No. <laughs> okay. Next week, we watch the cutscenes. The week after that, we do Kingdom Hearts 2. <laughs> my bad. I phrased it incorrectly. We will cut, watch the cutscenes next week, and then we will go to Kingdom Hearts 2. You don't have to cut me. Relax. <laughs> wow. People got real aggro real quick. People just taking out their box cutters and shit. That's scary, man. Box cutters hurt. You've obviously never been cut with a box cutter. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Next week, we'll watch the cutscenes. And tomorrow, we've got Mass Effect. So, tomorrow, Mass Effect. Next week, cutscenes for Kingdom Hearts.